Hello, hello. So you probably found yourself here because you purchased my daily page download for iPad Pro or have checked out my other products available on Etsy or seen the videos on YouTube. Um, so I just wanted to show you today how to download the JPEG file onto your iPad and then save it to your camera roll. And I prefer to actually create a custom album and then save all of my page JPEG files into that folder so that when I'm going into various apps, it's quicker for me to just go into that small album and open it up rather than search through my camera roll, which it might've gotten buried by images or whatever. Okay, so by this point you have made the purchase on Etsy. So you've purchased my iPad Pro file and then you have opened it on your desktop or laptop computer and saved the JPEG file and then emailed it to yourself. Um, I prefer emailing it to myself. You could also put it in Google Drive or Dropbox just for easy access. So at this point, I'm just going to open up my email. So you can see my two email files here. I emailed myself the daily page and my weekly planner. So what I'm gonna do is open it up and this is in Gmail, but the process is pretty similar in all email services. So here's the email, it has the JPEG file attachment, which I'm gonna open up. And then I just hit this download button in the upper right hand corner. You can see it says image saved in the bottom left. I'm gonna do the same thing for my weekly planner, which is just a little bit different of a layout that I like to use for weekly planning. So again, I'm gonna hit the download file. Again, it says images saved. I'm going to go ahead and close out of that. And then I'm gonna come back to my desktop here and under photos, you'll see that I have both of these files saved. So if I go to my photo album, you'll see my camera roll, which is my general one. Um, you have your recently deleted places people. Um, this is just what is generally in your iPad's photo library. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm actually gonna hit this plus sign in the upper left-hand corner to create a new album. It's gonna let me go ahead and title it and I'm just gonna do caps locks and title it pages. And then go ahead and hit save. And then you can see that it created an album for me called pages. And now it has opened up my entire camera roll. So if you have a lot of photos on your iPad, it's gonna go ahead and show you a ton of photos here. Um, but since I only have a couple saved, it's just gonna show me the two. I'm gonna hit select and then deselect this one because it's just like my little wallpaper background. And then I'm gonna select these two and hit done. So now you can see it's created this new album. And it's called pages. So now when I open up my favorite apps that I'm gonna use my page in, whether it's Procreate or Paper 53 or Sketch or Notes, um, all I'll have to do is hit the camera roll option and then select the pages album and all of my JPEG pages will just be organized right there for me. Easy peasy.